Okay. What's up, everybody? I'm back. Now, let's see if this will crash again. Will this crash? It is 10 p.m. now. Now it just turned 10 p.m. And it is October the 14th. You know, it's not like a May the 5th day. It's just October 14th. Okay, so there, there's actually something that I really should be doing instead of this right now. I should be giving my dog a butt bath, you know, because uh, he's older, so he doesn't... It's not, it doesn't come out as solid anymore, so it's uh, quite a mess back there. So whenever it's a mess, gotta bathe him, gotta clean up back there. I really should be doing that instead of this right now. But, rest assured, I will be giving him a bath after this. Alright, so let's get started. In a moment, let me just fix this up real quick. How you guys been? So you may have noticed that I didn't play this yesterday. And that's because last time I mentioned I had a dinner to go to. Now, to be honest with you guys, I start I finished that dinner quite early. I came home at like, I don't know, like 8.30, so I had plenty of time to get ready and prepare. So I, I did have time to do this. But then I decided not to. I thought, you know what, I already said I wasn't going to do this, and I haven't worked out in a few days, because, you know, I'm fat and I'm lazy and I hate exercising. So yesterday I decided not to do this, just so I could do some working out. Wait, what? Don't I need to go down now? That's odd. The game turned me around. Hey, so, uh, this shit hears that door to the depths, right? It should be. Why? What's wrong? I don't know. It looks just like all the other ones. I was thinking it's a little disappointing. Maybe we worked too hard to get down here or something. The lack of unforeseen circumstances is nothing to complain about. Let us continue. So I am very tired and very full. What the hell is this? It's some big fossil looking thing. So this must be the treasure. <clears throat> Wait, look on the side. It's the train running down to Mementos. So this is where that crowd of people was trying to reach? People are walking in and out of there, so the other side of the wall must be... Wait, it's not a wall, but... A giant door? Guess that means the treasure's not here. Come on, let's stay focused. Oh, what a surprise. I disconnected. Of course I did. It always happens. I always have to disconnect. Uh. Well, let's see how long this one takes me. Why does this always freaking happen? Like, I'm doing the exact same things all the time. Okay, let me do that. I don't get it. I'm doing the same setup as I always do. But for some reason, only recently, every time I do one of these, I just have to crash at the beginning. Okay, that doesn't look any better. Hold on, let me try... Let me try that again. Let's see. How's that? Okay, I think I'm back. I'm just gonna say I'm back and I'm just gonna get, get going. Is this 
thing seriously a door? How are we supposed to get past? It opened straight away. I bet that means the inner depths the MetaNav was talking about before are right ahead. Hold on. The door only opens from this side. What do you mean? Well, I took a quick peek at the mechanism inside the door, and it looks like you can only open it from here. We can get in, but nothing can get out. It's as though whatever lies within has been locked away. Wait, so you're saying that the people going in there are choosing a life of imprisonment? I have never felt such eeriness before. What is this place? We'll find out once we reach the depths. Come on, let's go. Oh, I completely forgot about this music. <clears throat> so I went out to dinner earlier tonight. It was a very last minute thing. My friends contacted me. as like, yo, what time do you get off? You want to go get some fried chicken for dinner? I'm just like, well, got to see if, uh, if I'm able to, if I got a ride. Depends on what my family's cooking up for dinner tonight. No. Sorry, I felt a burp coming. <clears throat> there we go. So, uh, my mom actually encouraged me to go out for dinner. Because, uh, because my sister was already going out for dinner. My sister's out for dinner right now. So it was just my parents eating, so, you know, less cooking for her to do. Less, to, less dishes to wash. And I only went out, like, real quick anyways. We didn't, like, sit but... down at a restaurant to eat. We went to a fried chicken restaurant kind of place. We got the fried chicken, we ate some there, and then we all went home. My friend, he, he came and picked all of us up and drove us all back home. He doesn't have a problem with it. He okay. says that it's good, it's good practicing for, like, his, uh, his driving test. Come on, man. Man, am I full, let me tell you that. I ordered like, so instead of a, the, the ordinary chicken sandwich, like the fried chicken sandwich, I ordered the like oh, mini chicken sandwich, which was already pretty big on its own. Although this was really just a piece of fried chicken in between two buns with a, like a little bit of mayo. And that's about it. And I ordered three of them. And I ate all three tonight. Hey, it could be worse. My friend ordered four. I can feel it. And as if that wasn't enough. All right. If that wasn't enough, I came home and there was a couple more things to eat as well. Wait, is this where I need to go? Hold on, what was over there? Pretty sure this is. Oh right, that's that. You just you dump. You don't want to go there. You jump off. You die. So I am supposed to come here. So I came home, I got leftovers that have to be eaten, so I did. So of my three chicken sandwiches, I ate two there. I saved one for home, I also ordered onion rings. Focus. Looks like a door here. Because it is a door, but we can't open it. I have some Anything else I should know about? No. <laughs> so yesterday I did go out to dinner. I had dinner with my sister's boyfriend's family. You know, his parents and grandma. His brother didn't go. Oh my god, let me, I, I gotta mute this.
I think the next time what the, the next time that song plays, I'll just let it happen. Because there's certain voice, there's certain characters that come back to voice act that I, you guys probably want to hear. So I'll just let Morgana. Oh, critical rate up and God's hand. Of course. Hopefully. Oh my god! Let's go. You can hit their weakness. Ravage them! Joker, you missed? I shall not falter. Prepare! Yo, Ryuji again? Wow, that one really doesn't want to get hit. Oh my god. Those sandwiches were good. Did you eat all four? Because I already ate all three. And I am stuffed. You only ate three of your four? Critical, wait, increases the chance of critical for one ally for three, I don't want that. That'd be useful, but I don't need it. That was careless of us. It should be no surprise that a prison has guards. Wait a sec, this is everyone's palace, right? Not like Kamoshida's castle. Who's keeping these people here? Mona-chan? I remember now. I've seen this place before. Hold on, though. It wasn't open until we came here today. Sorry, it's just a sense I'm getting. Still, it feels like I'm really close to remembering something important. You know, coming in here was what you wanted from the beginning. We just gotta keep moving on. On top of that, I'm curious to know who the ruler of this place is. Yeah, you're right. It's God. Wait, what about these people? Leave them be. They'll be taken care of if we erase mementos. <sighs> hey, it's dangerous to keep standing around here. Let's Take this. It's dangerous to go alone. Take this. So yeah, last night I went out to dinner. Show me your true form. Uh I'll reveal your true form. His mom had shorter hair and it was kind of puffy, kind of like a ball. You remember? God, what was the guy's name? What was that? What was that kid's name? Critical rate during an ambush. Now that sounds better. Revives with one HP when KO'd. Un, wait, usable once per battle. I, hmm. Revives with one HP when KO'd. Is that only me or is that my allies too? Because if it's only me, I kind of don't need this. No, wait, I guess it would be my allies. Once I get KO'd, I, the game's over. But you know what? I have moves that can revive with full HP, so I guess it's, I guess it's fine. But yeah, you remember the kid's name in the Lorax? How his mom looked? Kind of like that. Only, you know, a little bit older. And not as big of an afro. I can feel it. for the trees. That was a good movie too. Hmm. I think the first time I watched that film was when I was on a plane, actually. I was on a plane to Asia, you know, as a family vacation, family trip back to visit some family, and I watched that film on the plane.
But yeah, I went to dinner. <clears throat> I went to dinner with him. We went to a vegetarian restaurant because his grandma, his grandma is vegetarian. Like she just can't handle meat. <laughs> you know, some people they literally are unable to digest meat. Like they get. Well, uh, I, I guess. I guess the way you phrase it is they get sick from it. Kind of like how some people are lactose intolerant. They just can't. They can't handle dairy. Mm. <clears throat> so, because of his grandma, we went to a vegetarian restaurant. I think this may be the first genuine, fully vegetarian meal of my life. You know, you think about it, like how many meat dishes there are or meat items there are in dishes. You know, and sometimes you get fried rice, there's like bits of meat in there. You get like... All right. Uh, you get like fried fish. You get... Mmm, kind of blanking on stuff, on stuff right now. Oh, wait, what am I doing? <clears throat> Just uh, yep, yep. give her the coleslaw and the tomatoes. From what tomatoes? The sandwiches we had didn't have didn't have tomatoes. So let's see. Okay. Uh, I'm trying to. Th this is the easiest one. This is the first one. Why am I? But yeah, I think uh, I think with me, the problem with me and vegetarian food is that it's just not really that filling. At least I don't think so. You know, it's not that filling, so you have to eat more. But the the issue is the food, at least to me, just isn't that appealing because it's all Let's vegan. Go. It's just like great, hey, more tofu, more more of these flaky stuff, more imitation meat. Now, how do I do this? Because I need all of them blue. Issue is, I can't jump. Oh, I, I, I see it. I see what I need to do. This was the easiest one. Why, I, why am I messing up on this? And I completely messed up. Because with this spot, you were supposed to come back. Okay, I did it like that as well. What? I messed that up. That was the first puzzle. That was the easiest puzzle, and I messed that up. But it's okay. You know, we had a lot of deep fried stuff. We had a lot of like fried imitation pork, fried imitation fish. We had, uh, well, of course, fried tofu. We had. Huh? What? What else do we have? We had, we had fried, well, fried flakes, like the the veg, yep. the the vegetable flaky things, the flakes, like the the pastries, the puff pastries type of stuff. Hmm. It's like a sheet of vegan stuff. Great. So I need to figure out a way to get back there. I can't just jump, you know? I can't just jump in the air and land back down and it'd be blue. Yeah. <sighs> hey, I ain't been getting enough sleep these last few days. Nor did I get any caffeine. So, very tired right now. <clears throat> we also had... This is, this, is, this is interesting. We had fried milk. But it was, it was vegan milk. It was, actually, it was actually the coconut milk. You know, the, 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 the canned coconut milk. 
damn it. Deep fried canned coconut milk. They actually had to bring it out twice. The first time. Oh my god. Wait a second, they're behind us. I can see it. But they're green, so I can just kill you with my dad. Oh, don't you run away. You're. You shall succumb to this dab as well. Power courses through me. But yeah, the first time they brought out the the fried milk, the fried coconut milk, they actually said that it was too dark. You know, it was like overdone. So they sent it back, and they brought. They had to make a new batch, and this time it was that golden brown, crispy texture. I mean, what's there to harp about? It was deep fried coconut milk. I, un I vaguely understand how people can like deep fry a liquid. You guys ever been to like one of those fairs where they serve like deep fried Kool-Aid, deep fried butter? Well, with butter, I know you could just freeze it, batter it, and then fry it. Show me your true but when it's a, a you know a liquid, yeah, that that gets me a little more confused. Like, do they mix like gelatin powder into it? I'll your they they refrigerate it, or maybe they even freeze it and then they fry it. <laughs> have you have you ever tried that Egyptian emp emperor water, but deep fried? Yo, deep fried water. You know that's actually a thing, right? People actually have made deep fried water. I'll reveal your true form. There's actually a video about it. Prison officer badge. How do I get back? Do I need to jump down? Yep. Dog? No. Okay, I not- Oh, I already got it. That's why. There's nothing in there. So at the, at the end of the dinner, I, uh, I went to go buy a drink. Because we were right next to that place. And I was in the ro I was in the car with my sister and her boyfriend. My sister asked me, you know, like, what'd you think? How was the dinner? I'm just like, what do you want me to say? Like, how, how do you want me to respond to that? What do you want me to say? You have a beautiful family. Is that what you expect me to say? It's like, I can't believe you came from those two studs. Is that what you expect me to say? Like, what can I say besides it was just a, a fine dinner? It was an ordinary dinner just with them. Wait a second. Get back here! Get back here! No! Oh, I couldn't, I couldn't dab to kill you. That's fine. Let's see. Ice and... Ice and fire. Do I have any ice moves? No, I don't. I do not have any ice moves. Uh, don't you... I can't... Yeah, I can't use fire on you. Well, the best I can do right now... Oh wow, never mind, that almost took you out anyways. I was about to use Miracle Punch on you. You're strong against wind, but hopefully this will just kill you. Yes. I should maybe put Yusuke on the team then. Okay. Shadow defeated! That was easy, huh? Let's see, take out Ryuji, put on Yusuke. I can see it. I wait, no, don't change the don't change the camera angle. Show me your true form. 
Now, was there anything back there I need to know about? No. <coughs> okay. So, after I got that shiny Burmy and I evolved it into a shiny Venomoth, I was wondering, like, what can I hunt next since I kind of don't have anything to hunt? Well, I decided on what I'm going to shiny hunt next. Or so I thought. Because this was a hunt that I attempted to do a while ago. Maybe a year ago, but then I stopped to hunt other stuff. Focus. I was actually going to do these two hunts before I did the Burmy hunt. Because <laughs> I wanted to get a shiny Venomoth. Then a shiny Masquerade, and then get a shiny Mothum, because I like the way those three shinies look. Those three bug type shinies just look good to me, so I wanted to do them in, you know, Pokedex order. So I tried hunting a Venonat a while ago, but I just gave up on it and I hunted something else. So now that, you know, I've already got the shiny Burmy, and I, I don't have anything else to hunt, I went back and I hunted it. Here I thought I was getting ready to do the next thing to shiny hunt. And what do you know? I got the shiny Venomoth and only 55 eggs. Is this gonna work? There we go. So yeah, I already got the shiny Venomoth. Venonat to evolve into a Venomoth. I got that yesterday. So now that I got the shiny Burmy and the shiny Venomoth, up next is the shiny Mas- no, shiny Surskit to evolve into a shiny Masquerade. Masquerade? Masquerade. No, Masquerade is the Bakugan character. As a kid, I always got the two confused. Masquerade and Masquerade. <clears throat> Masquerade Shadow Legends, a sponsor. No, I'm kidding. <clears throat> and guess what? I got the shiny Surskit today as well. This one was a little bit longer. This one took 245 eggs. But regardless, I got the two shinies, and I truly have nothing to hunt now. I just gotta find something random to hunt again. Show me your true form. But yeah, these are shinies that I never had before. I've always wanted to get them, but I never, never did actually get them. But now I got them. A shiny Venomoth. Shiny Masquerade, and a Shiny Motham. I've always really liked these Shinies, this but I just never got them. We can use it as a safe room. Uh, sure. Just add this. Fine, I'll save the game, why not? Okay, let's get back to exploring. <clears throat> See it. Now, there is a point in this game coming up where Life Will Change will play for quite a long time. So I kind of have to let that play out and just deal with the copyright thing afterwards. I just have to deal with that afterwards. Because if I mute it, I may I may be silent for like 15, 20 minutes and no one's going to watch that. And <laughs> that's especially no one's going to watch that afterwards, after it's posted either. But it is what it is. All right. So no more ahead of me. Simple enough. I actually did that one easier than the first puzzle. <sighs> Whoa. Good 
Go on, add infin infinitum. What? Well, there's nothing else in this room, so we just gotta gotta go down. Get in. We don't have time to go down on foot. This area is more red again. Uh oh, we got more cages. I think I'll just let this play out. What? You're Kamoshida. Since no, Madarame. Kaneshiro's over here. Is President Okumura here too? Father isn't around anymore. Sorry. No, it's okay. Haven't you learned anything in school? The collective ruler of a democratic country is...
Well, that part just now was muted, so you guys heard nothing there. I can feel it. Show me your Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Weren't these guys like weak to fire? Yeah. Blaze in hell. Man, this will, won't this just one shot them all? Or I guess not. I was about to say, if it's just gonna one shot all of them, I wish I had one that was weaker. But clearly not, never mind. <clears throat> oh yeah, uh, yesterday, what, today's Friday, right? Yeah, today's Friday, so yesterday on Thursday was the, was the season finale to She-Hulk. What the fuck did I watch? My god, what, what did they do? It was, it was just so messy. It was interesting, it was kind of cool, but it was just too much. It was, it just, it did feel so messy. And you know, this is like, once again, my theorist brain just, just jumps to so many, so many possible explanations. Like, so many things to think about now moving forward. Like, okay, now we know for sure that everything in the MCU is fiction, as if we needed that any more confirmed. But like, all of everything we've seen is now canonically, like, spat out by a, uh, excuse me, a Wally -E Captain style AI robot named Kevin, or K E V I N, for an acronym. You know, clearly ripping on Kevin Feige. Whoa. That sound scared me for a second. You know, it was even reported that they wanted Kevin Feige to voice the robot, but he refused to. And then, you know, stuff like Bruce Banner, Deus Ex Monica, Monica? Deus Ex Machina. Style just uh, came in out of nowhere to save the day, and the same thing for Dare Daredevil too. He just at the very end he just like jumped out of nowhere. He's like, where did he come from? There weren't any tall buildings nearby. Didn't he leave for New York in the last episode? And yes, I know, I know Jen rewrote the ending. Wait! Oh, I wish I ambushed that one. Can I talk? Uh, you're level 75. Am I level 75? Whatever, I'll just kill you. <clears throat> My god, that did nothing to you. Bravely matched here. Just don't let your guard down. Man, I should have just talked to you. Did you hear Morgana sneeze just now? Let's go. Take this! Would ice even work on you? I'm gonna try this. Nope! Don't do that! See, if only I ambushed you, I could've used this. Should I just run? I feel like I should just run. I mean, it's not like a... It's not like a palace where there's... A detection meter. Or, uh, never mind, there is. What am I saying? Of course there was. Right, I completely forgot this place has one too. Because this is the palace of the masses, of the general public. <clears throat> Wh 
Whoa! Show me your true form. What you got to say? I can see it all online. It'd be a pain actually going anywhere. You're not wrong about that. <sighs> I'm so exhausted today. Focus. <gasps> Maybe I make this one a little bit shorter. Because like I said, I do have my dog to bathe afterwards. And I am so exhausted today. I mean, I've already been going on for like 45 minutes. I can get to the end of the Depths of Mementos and then just call it there, I guess. I don't have ice. Oh wait, I do have ice. I put Yusuke on. money at maxed out neat did I talk to you yet about Kamoshida and all the others? <sighs> oh my god, I'm yawning so much. I'm yawning more than burping this time. So I need to get to the door over there. Yo, yo, can I not jump? Yo! Yo, get- thank you! Jeez, I was mashing the button to jump down and it just wouldn't let me. Anything else? What's up there, I wonder? On the one step I didn't take a look at. <gasps> Nothing! <clears throat> My favorite. Hide. I can feel it. Show me your true form. Okay. So I go forward this way, but I see that over there, and I want this. 
Silent Horn. The effect of the cognitive world is weak here. There may be a safe room close by. Huh. It looks like we can use this place to rest. Let's do it. So you guys want to know, you guys want to know one reason why I'm single? Why I'm going to hell? Today I spent an absurd amount of money. What the hell? Today I bought the four Doki Doki Literature Club U2s. You know, it was announced quite a while ago. And today I bought all four of them all at once. You know, it was $30 a piece. $30 USD. This is strange. So $120 USD. And then plus the $20 shipping. Plus tax. And then you have to convert it to Canadian. All in all, it was about $200 for me. Two, oh my god. $200 for four figures. Four collectibles. Let's go. But wait. There's more. There's more. Because today I also pre-ordered three amiibos i pre-ordered the three splatoon 3 amiibos because those are as of this moment only up for pre-order hmm, you're shameless you're, you're right i am how dare you give me that lip when you're in when you you've intruded this far into here And the pre-order for the three of them was like 75-ish bucks. So I spent almost $300 in a day. Not counting the food I bought. You know, those fried chicken sandwiches I bought. Which were like... All in all was like, what? 16 bucks? 6, 17 bucks? No wind skills. It's powerful, so stay on guard. I need nuke. It's kind of cool how they spin around. Don't kill, please don't kill. Yes! Oh, I should have used Morgana to heal, that's okay. I'll, I'll just auto heal afterwards. Am I the only one who's always been, like, sort of intrigued by vehicles that are just one wheel? Kind of like the Vilorex? It's somewhere. Give me this. A big button. I want to push it. By the way... to pour myself some more water I had a lot of fatty stuff so I need to you know try to try to wash it all down by drinking way more water that's another reason that I didn't do this last night and why I chose to exercise for once in my fat ass life you know I had eaten a lot of cheese lately so I had to kind of you know try my best to unclog those arteries of all the lard that was you know filling them up blocking my circulation <sighs> Drinking so much water doesn't help, given how already bloated and full I am from how much I ate today. You know, I don't need to talk to all these guys, I just want to. <clears throat> Resigned middle-aged man. Ah, this is not where I need to go. Well, it kind of is, because I needed that key. It's somewhere. I'll reveal your true form. I I smell another puzzle. Okay. 
This one seems simple enough. Okay, I see what I need to do here. I think. Yeah, like that. Wait, it's somewhere. This is... I thought you could climb onto that platform and then, you know, just walk on the last three. We could try jumping in the air. Excuse me. <sighs> So I need to come and deactivate this first. Notice something right here. Ah, the butt plug fi fits in perfectly. Now we have a little space. Clockwise, last day, last day, last time. I can't even think straight now. We went clockwise last time. Now we should go counterclockwise. <clears throat> Excuse me. I need to clear my throat sometimes. far underground at this point. I hope we don't suddenly find ourselves in a giant pool of lava. Still, we gotta keep going. It's still going down? We're not balls deep in yet? Guys, look! Doesn't that cell seem... Different from the others? It's the Velvet Room! Wait, could this be that quarantine cell? Supposedly, the most sinful, most dangerous inmate is held within. Aw, oh, you're too flattering. This, this place smells familiar for some reason. Smells Monitor? familiar. There's no mistake. This is it. I was born here. Born? Inside the prison? Wait, then are you the dangerous inmate? No, the inmate wasn't me. But I remember this place. Someone created me here to guide all of you. Guide? And who is this someone? Oh, I can't remember. Damn it, I'm so close. My memory is too foggy. You know... Hearing all this just makes me want to know what's inside. We found them. The escapees are in front of the isolated cell. Alert! Alert! Capture them at once! Haven't seen these guys yet. We're surrounded. We gotta win this, guys! <clears throat> win, so maybe weak to electric? I guess the mate now no. Let's do this! Well, at least that did a good amount to them. Oh, you're burned? Let me cool you off real quick. My eye is itching. 
Alright, level up. My eyes have been burning all day from staring at my switch screen, shiny hunting a surskit all day. At least I got it. This place seems to be under high alert now. We should keep going. Given how important this cell appears to be, the depths of Mementos must be near. Mona's memories may return if we continue on. Yeah. So, we're finally getting close to the public's treasure, huh? Now that I think about it, it makes sense Mementos would connect to some place like underneath Shibuya. Everyone crams themselves into packed underground boxes day after day without any complaints. Well, that's the only way of transportation. From my standpoint, those are the true inmates of Mementos. It's no surprise the places are connected. You know, the voices of the public may have led the Phantom Thieves on more than any criminal. Seriously! Let's hurry up and steal that treasure so we can crush Mementos. We truly are reforming society. Let's go! I can see it. You're green as well. Get over here! Oh, come on! That was a perfect setup, too, and it's Thor. No weaknesses. Wait, what, did, what can I use? Which I don't have. Well, I probably do. I just, I'm just too lazy to look into it. What else do I have? There are doors of Hades, you. How about that? They're a lot less than I thought. Are you even trying? This is my other self. It isn't a major So I can use wind on you. Oh man. You again? No weaknesses? Wait. No weakness. Yes, I can use fire. You want more? It might not have a weakness. So no ice. No ice and strong to melee, so gun it is. And wind. Strong gets wind. How about doors of Hades instead? I can do this, you know. Yes. Understood. pretty good, We all did great, huh? Okay, let's move on. Okay. Very well. Next. Okay. Very much looks like a colon. Focus. I'll reveal your true form. And I, I know there's one more right here. I'll reveal your true form. Let's see. He. I saw that. I saw you. Gold emblem. Wouldn't mind having me one of those. Is it pure gold or is it just colored gold? Is it that fake ass gold? Like just a, a yellow piece of metal? Am I the only one who ever saw gold like that? I always saw gold, the color gold, as just a shiny yellow. Am I the only one who saw that? I also, I also always just saw silver as a shiny gray. Like if you want, just turn gray, maybe a little bit brighter and shinier, sparklier. There you go. Now you have the color silver. And the same goes with gold. Maybe like darken the yellow a bit, make it shinier and glittier, glittier, glitter, glitterer, glitter, er, make it glitter more, make it sparkle more. And there you have gold. That's the way I always saw gold and silver, just shinier yellow and gray. I can feel it. Show me your true form. The effects of 
transmission are low here. Is there a safe room nearby? Yes, there's a safe room right in front of us. Oh, a new safe room. Save the game. Something. Let's get back to exploring. Oh, I'll take that. I didn't even see that there. What's good? Good. Now I can fight better. Wow. Don't usually hear Joker speak. I, that might be the, my first time hearing Joker say that line. Now I can fight better. I've never heard him say that before. I, did I see a grappling hook option just now? Yep. Let me Spider-Man my way up here. A chest. Talk about luck. A black rock. Better than nothing, I guess. I have something. Now how do I get down? That's quite a tall jump as well. So I need to go forward, but uh, is there a puzzle around here? Like, what's this? Oh, nothing. It's just a wall. I thought there was a, a floor pattern puzzle again. It's somewhere. Just checking for anything to take. Invisible platform. It doesn't. Not really even visible on the map. Oh, gee, I wonder how I'm going to solve this. That was so hard. I really had to think hard for that one. I almost couldn't solve that one. What, those what could those floor patterns have mean? It means we're about to encounter a Reggie. Are we about to get the Reggie Rock, Reggie Ice, Reggie Steel, you know, oon, oon, oon? Like, which one are we gonna encounter? I don't have all three of them on my team, so we can't encounter Reggie Gigas. Or at least, I guess now, we can say we don't have all five on the team. Wow. Call me crazy. Have I, I always thought Reggie Rock was the tallest of the trio because of the movie. I can feel it. Lucario and the Mystery of Mew, that movie. I always thought Reggie Rock was the tallest of the trio. And then I found out years later, I only found out like maybe last year, that no, Reggie Rock is the shortest of the trio. And Reggie Steele is the tallest of them. I'm just like, wait, really? Reggie Rock is that tiny compared to them? I always thought Reggie Rock was the tallest. Rock, Ice, and Steel, I thought Rock was the tallest of the three. It's because of the movie, it just looked taller. At least to me it did. Just checking around, just looking at our surroundings. Broken baton? What's that gonna sell for? What's EY gonna pay for that? A dollar? It's like, you're selling me something broken? Why would I want that? Ugh. Okay. Wait, too far. Not that way. Was there anything before? Yes, but we need this. Take the butt plug. Hmm. 
Oh, hello. What do you have to say there, my good man? Cold businessman? I'm pissed off that people like you even exist. Yes. My apologies, but we did, we did not come here to seek here. Wait. We did not come here seeking approval. We got wait, no. Oh, we we got to we got to put this thing back in first. Nope, don't even bother trying. Turn it off. Anyone else see an owl design there? Uh, I'll, I'll point it out again in a second. Like right here, anyone else see like an owl design? Yo, the, the Court of Owls? Is that where we're at? The Court of Owls? Alright, so we got the butt plug. Plug it at, plug it back into the butt. There we go. I can solve these easier than solving a Rubik's Cube. I don't know how to solve a Rubik's Cube. <clears throat> Whoa! Certainly didn't expect anyone to be right around the corner. Wait, come back here! Come back here! Your true form. Where's the other one at? There you are. Focus. I'll reveal your true form. Tidy prison uniform. Is that what that said? Uniform? Anything else I should steal? No? Form. Oh, another one right there. Show me your true form. Anything around here, around these spots. Wait, what's that? There's nothing in there though. Alright, man. What your bitch ass got to say? I won't request anything of you. Well, you kind of did request something, and that is to leave you alone. So, uh, funny story. So, I saw this tweet. I saw this tweet. Maybe I'll link it down below. It's the, like, the, the stocks for Warner Brothers Discovery. And then it says, like, David Zaslav is doing such a great job. And then it shows a picture of Mr. Krabs in a destroyed Krusty Krab sitting there smiling. So I sent it to a couple of people online, uh, like on Discord, who, you know, do follow DC stuff, like all the all the chaos that's been happening at the company lately. And one person responded to me, well, someone I've, someone I've met on Discord, someone I talk to occasionally, about like DC content. So we were chatting. I, I sent him this. He was like, David Zaslav. Has you know cleaned up the DCEU? And I'm just like, how did he clean it up? What 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 did he do to clean up the DCEU? And how big of a mess that is? Like the only thing, the only thing good that I can I guess I can say that David Zaslav has done is you know cancel some woke content, cancel a couple of woke projects. And then he was like, no, no, this is where he said he did more. He fixed the DCEU. And I'm just like, how? How did he fix the DCEU? So he replied by saying that he canceled the Batgirl film. You know, so that plot hole is out of the way. That plot hole doesn't have to be worried about anymore. I'm just like, that's not really much of a plot hole. More of a poor release order. Because, you know, I thought he meant the plot hole of of, of, of of Michael Keaton's Batman showing up in Aquaman when that's 
continuity that's followed by the Flash film. So it's kind of just poor release date, but he's like, no, that's not the plot hole I mean. I'm like, oh, well, what plot hole did you mean? He was talking about, this is... he was talking about Brendan Fraser playing Firefly, the main villain in the film. I'm just like, how is that a plot hole? And then he said, because he plays Robot Man. I'm just like, yes. what's the plot hole? Doom Patrol is set in another universe compared to the DCEU. There's no plot hole here. What plot hole are you talking about? And he was like, you know what? Let's agree to disagree. I'm just like, disagree on what? There's no plot hole here. They are different continuities. Brendan Fraser plays one character in this universe. He can play this character in another universe. There is no plot hole here. I can see it. Anyways, what did I do wrong here? Clearly, I'm doing something wrong here. Yet, yeah, there's no continuity error. I have something. Like, we've seen doppelgangers in the DC multiverse before. Oh! Wait a second, I now remember that the white dots on the floor means how many steps we're allowed to take, or errors we're allowed to make. Right, I forgot about that. Oh no, not errors. That is that does mean how many steps we can take. All right, court of owls, your tricks won't fool us. Okay, what that do? Now we can do this one. Oh, I messed that up. Okay, I see where I did. I see where I went wrong there. I messed that one up. Yep, I see where I. I see where I went wrong there. Let's try that one once more. So I'm meant to step on this, then get off of it, and do it like this. Okay. Ooh, look what's up ahead. Yes. I'm trying to remember the order of events. Wait a second. This feeling. I have something. I think there's a safe room around here. We found a safe room. I'm trying to remember what the order of events is here. I should write something. Right, I think we fight the Holy Grail, and then we go to the Velvet Room. Let's get back to exploring. I think that's how the I think that's how it plays out, yeah. The hell is this? It's huge. I didn't realize such a gigantic place existed here. Is this where everyone's treasure is held? Yeah, that should be the case. But this ominously bizarre air about it. It almost feels like a temple of sorts. Although Look, th there's no point freaking out now. Come on, let's go.
I think they added that for this game. I think in the vanilla game, you just walk there. Prison of... Oh, I can't finish reading that. <clears throat> I can feel it. Huh? Please give me what I want. Just end it all. A. I can't disagree with you there. <clears throat> we'll be free from everything. I have a gut feeling Desire is going to play. I think I'll just let it play. I'll just deal with muting it afterwards. Just for you guys. How about that? Happy young man. As long as I have it, I don't need anything else. The Phantom Thieves? Keep your hands off it. How about no? Excuse me, I muted myself to clear my throat extra loud, extra hard. I, at least I think I muted myself. Did you guys hear that? Look at just how many. It looks like a grid. It looks like a digital screen. Wait, that's not the way down. This is. No. Whoa. Now that's quite an angle. <laughs> I can't climb up. <clears throat> the depths of mementos is likely what awaits us down here. Are you ready to descend? I did save the game, right? Hold on. Yes. I did save the game, right? I'm pretty sure I did. Let me let me just be safe and save it one more time. I'm pretty sure I saved the game. But just to be safe, let me save it once more. How do I get out of here? Can I even get back over there? Because I did the grappling hook. Oh, I wait, what? I was about to say, I guess it just won't show me going back. No! I can't even see where I am. Oh, there we are. Well, at least that's how it looks coming back here. I don't I don't think many people saw that, saw that how it looks coming back over here. Yep. Oh, yeah, I'm pretty sure I did save the game. And now I'm just wasting time. Let's do it. But just to be safe. There. Now I now I know for sure I saved the game. Okay, let's move on. Wrong way. Did the two of you have something to say? Who is it to blame for the multitude of problems in the world? I feel sick just thinking about it. All I can do, all I can really do now is ignore it. I suppose. You're not wrong about that. You can't be mad at him for doing that. We're just ignoring it. There's, there's not really anything we can do but to ignore it. You know, you see online like all this crazy shit that haps on, happens in the world, that goes on in the world. You can't really do anything but ignore it. Well, it depends on what it is. You know, there's like a mass shooting. There's nothing you can do about it. There's a bank robbery. You can't do anything about it. You know, something else like there's... We're, we're leaving a, a bigger carbon footprint behind. I guess you could do something about that. You can, you can, you know, walk to work instead of drive there. You can plant more trees. Like, I guess that's something you can do. That's something you can do something about. But a lot of the negative stuff you see on the news, you can't do anything about it except just ignore it. So 
So you can't really be mad at him for doing that, Ryuji. Okay, I have indeed saved the game, so let's continue. Let's go. The hell? Look at how many there are. Are these all prison cells? And what's that thing in the middle? Whatever it is, it looks disgustingly grand. Cup? There are no other passages leading out of this room. It appears this is our final destination. The depths of mementos. In that case, is the treasure of Memento somewhere in here? I think you're right. <coughs> I've never been here, but I can sense it. There's no mistaking that presence. If we get rid of it... <clears throat> if we get rid of it, the public should come to its senses. But something that large will be impossible to carry out of here. We just gotta make it disappear, right? If we can't move it, then we'll just have to destroy it. Yeah, that will work. Once we do that, the entire metaverse is going to disappear, right? This is finally it. Oh, I guess it's no surprise we've been discovered. That thing isn't gonna sit back and let itself get destroyed. Even the inmates are starting to liven up. How eerie. They're planning something. That must mean this thing's got to be the treasure. He saved us the trouble of checking. Hold on. Something's off. Shido said the masses are allowing themselves to be held captive here. Could they truly be operating this gigantic system that eliminates intruders on its own? Prison guards and soldiers were very organized, too. Are you trying to say that someone else rules this place? Is it not the public? <laughs> what was that? We don't have time to worry about that. Leave it for later. What do you mean you don't have time? Right, guys. Like that's not a concern. We lose now. Yeah, boss theme. Rivers in the desert fighting a literal cup. Let's hurry up and destroy this thing. Everyone, give it your all. All right, let's do it. Notice the two hands on the side. Let's go. What else do I have? Fafnir. Do I have a strong move that doesn't take too much SP right now? Well, I guess it doesn't matter anyways. Them. Oh, I didn't heal. That's okay. This is my other self. Arrow of light. Is it using the bow of light? This is why you need to use physical attacks for long bosses. SP runs out too fast. Maybe when this thing turns to the Holy Grail, I will. But not when it's like this. I when it looks like the mechanism for a watch. Yeah, it looks like War of the Worlds. Anyone remember that film? What was that? Had Tom Cruise in it? That was Tom Cruise, right? Don't tell me. Are the inmates giving it their strength? Damn it! This is never gonna end! It seems hopeless if there are this many inmates supporting it. Give it a haircut. You fool. 
souls, human, yet wishing to eradicate the desires of humanity. Does this voice sound familiar? We've been hearing it the entire game. Repent. The treasure's talking. I am revered as the grantor of dreams for all who behold me. A being most commonly known as the Holy Grail. The Holy Grail. The prison of regression is representative of the collective desires of humanity. They wish to be chained down, surrender their cognition, and neglect the world around them. These feeble-minded common folk will make your social reform all for naught. The shared heart of the masses has fallen into an excess of indolence and transformed into a prison. In that thing. Thus, the only suitable end for them is to perish within the prison they wished for themselves. Get ready! Here it comes! Hell yeah! Yeah, the music just starts over. Great, I need Damn to heal. Thing. Let's break it for sure this time. Persona! Ravage them! Persona! Wait, no, let me heal. Uh, this one. Damn, that's a lot of SP, though. Mm, you know what? I'll hold off and let Yusuke do a physical move first, and then I'll heal. But for now... Persona. Do I have something that can maybe... Well, I was about to say increase my attack, but I don't know if that's really even necessary. I am Zhao. I love the way that guy sounds. <laughs> Stop! Stop it! Oh jeez, don't 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 heal it just a little bit. We can't lose. Keep attacking. You know, don't go light on healing it. Wait, it's color. Persona. I feel like if I guard, I won't even progress. If I just don't attack at all, I won't progress. The song is awesome, by the way. Oh, not again! I knew it. Every time that thing heals, its color changes. Let's go. You know, it would be great if you would finish what you were saying instead of making us go one turn each. I am thou. No, I actually do this one. Out of 10 screaming? Hell yeah. That's some 11 out of 10 voice acting. If this is really how people feel, 
There's no way we'll be able to steal their hearts. We've come here for nothing. This is horrible. You imbeciles are intoxicated by an undesired justice. We'll just come back here holding a this tactical nuke. That'll fix this. Who have fallen into sloth. My shine is proof that they desire my existence. As long as humanity yearns for me, I shall never perish. They just had a group of people constantly this repeat really get out of here in front of a mic. Stop thinking and be guided by the Holy Grail? You know, they just had them repeat these words over and over and they're just playing it on loop. Yes. It's so frustrating. It makes me want to cry. But I... I will never agree. The humans I look up to aren't like that. No matter how painful reality is, it's all over if you don't try to change how things are. I'm not the only one who believes that. Everyone here agrees. We don't want to turn back into the people we used to be. That's why we risked our lives coming here. Mona-chan. He's right. Humanity already wishes for their distortions to be actualized. I am merely the being that will ultimately grant those wishes. Now, it is time I refrain from my place in this world and begin to encroach upon reality itself. Encroach. And I just bit my lip saying that. Shit. Encroach? What is it gonna do? Hey, this doesn't look good. I've got a bad feeling about this. Mona, what should we do? I don't know what you are. Run for our lives. You can't keep arbitrarily deciding all this on your own. Humans aren't all stupid like you say they are. Hmm. Indolent, foolish humans. You shall offer your hearts to me. Time for the fusion has come. Hey, the grounds. It's vanishing? <laughs> Hell no. I think I know where I'm gonna stop this. It's after the velvet room I wanna stop this. But who knows that? Who? Who's that? No way, I see. So that's how it was. I remember everything now. I didn't get you are my from that at all. Ow. Is everyone okay? Uh, of course we are. Oh, hey, our clothes are back to normal. Look! Huh? Shibuya? We're back. We didn't come back ourselves, though. We must have been driven out by the Holy Grail. Did we lose? Mm. I guess. We can't give up. I know that, but... What the hell? 
Sojiro looks like he has a much smaller chin in anime form. No way! You gotta be shitting me! <laughs> Is Desire about to play? Nope. Huh? What is this, a dream? It's interesting how only the confidants see these. <sighs> the hell is this? What's going on? Only confidants Kauru. can see these. Kauru. Talk about plot armor. Huh? Is this scenery? For real? What on earth? God, ah, uh, how was this? Impossible. What's the for real counter on? This? Damn, looks like I should take this seriously. Huh? No way. Wait, what the? What's this pink stuff? Pepto Bismol. It's the river of slime from Ghostbusters. <laughs> no. Something wrong has happened to the world. Hmm? What's going on here? What the hell's happening here? I can't believe this. Why is everyone acting normal? Don't they see this? I hope those kids are safe. Unbelievable. This isn't a world inside a game, right? Everyone else isn't seeing this? Man, what great weather. Want to go for a drive? Hello. Yes, it's about tomorrow's preliminary meeting. Uh, the announcement for the new smartphones tonight. Yo, which well, iPhone is it? What are the Phantom Thieves all about anyway? Oh, man. Hearing that brings back memories. I feel so dumb for even believing they existed. It was fun news, though. Well, I doubt anyone believes they're around anymore. Why isn't anyone noticing this abnormality? It's probably because they don't feel that it's odd. <sighs> What's wrong? Oh, I feel woozy. Uh, Futaba! Souls are about to disappear from the people's cognition. That damn voice! Mementos and reality have become one. Must those who have disappeared...
Damn, unfortunately, that whole section had to be muted. After it's posted, of course. After this is posted. In the end, your rehabilitation was not carried through. There's gonna be a lot it of appears, silent moments in this. I have and the next part as well. <laughs> your voice. You Doesn't it sound familiar? The assistance that we provided was all for naught. Humans are more apathetic and more foolish than I had thought them to you be. You just call us pathetic? The world will soon I know he said see apathetic. You have lost the game. You were meant to bring change to mankind as a trickster, but it seems that was too much for you. In accordance to the game's rules, the defeated must pay a price. Your life is forfeit. I sentence you to be executed. <gasps> executed? God's decree is absolute. My experiment has come to naught. Everything is over. Grant that man a swift death. If that's what our master wishes, it, it just means that you weren't an upstanding prisoner. That may be true, but... What is the matter? Carry out his sentence at once. Are we really going to kill him? Don't falter now! It's all his fault for losing the game! All right, inmate. We now proceed to the execution of your sentence. Show your rebellious will after all that. Ready, Justine? If our master orders so, then it cannot be helped. Let us show our strength to this prisoner who just doesn't know when to give up. Understood. Death to the criminal. That has to be one of the coolest moments in this game. One's final moment should be spent in good grace. Cannot move! Can't move again! This power... Caroline, it's as I thought. What's the matter? I told you not to falter! Are you going against our master's orders? Take this. Looks cool. No, this isn't right. Our duty isn't to kill him. Caroline! What gives? Why am I doubting myself? Is there another duty left to us? I believe I ordered his execution. Uh, uh, Master, have you forsaken humanity? We are wardens, those who rehabilitate prisoners. What? Something speaks to me in my mind. Our true duty is not to kill. How... Please, help. 
We've heard that voice before. Who? Yes, we are those who wish for true rehabilitation. We are not executioners. That is the truth we had forgotten. We've decided. We will not forsake humanity. <laughs> Your right eye... ...and my left. It's as if they're the same... ...yet mirrored. Ah! Uh, now is the time for our wish to be realized. I finally remember how we were torn apart. We were originally one. Yet we were torn asunder into halves by malevolent intent. <laughs> so we were captives, same as you. To think we'd learn that truth from a prisoner. Let us reclaim our true form. Hey, we'll give you your last job. Be thankful and obey. You must fuse us together with your own hands. It's time you return the favor for us assisting with your growth. Do it with care. Now! Fuse us! My name is Lavenza. I was torn apart by a malevolent will and took the form of those twins. I sought help before my body was split in two. Uh, a, malevent, a malevolent will? If we lose you, the path to the Holy Grail will forever be closed. That's why you must recall the truth once more. And I beg of you, please, save us. I wonder who remembers these. I believed in you. I knew that you would make it thus far. And to the scoundrel who has swindled my master's name, your lies shall work no longer now that my sight has been restored. The game isn't over yet. Whether the human world is left as is, or destroyed and rebuilt, it is all sport to me. Be careful. If I were to put it into words that you can comprehend, I am the Holy Grail that grants wishes. No. It may be more accurate to say that I am a god who responds to desire and holds dominion over man. I hope seeing a righteous thief vanquish evil would spur mankind to change their own indolent hearts. However, the result is, as you know, the masses have made it so none of it has transpired. Humans should be met with ruin. You brought forth that answer. But to be frank, inmate, I believe it may be worth re-evaluating you. A human has reached the Holy Grail and has seen through my true identity. 
You've surprised the god that I am often enough. That cannot be done by a foolish commoner. You truly were a prisoner that did not fool me. Well, glad to keep you entertained. I am the oh, Thou art I. Random ass Thou timing. Hast my Thou hast awakened the ultimate secret of the fool. Damn. Grant this one had to be the fool as well. All right. Eh, it's not really a it's not really a a deal with Igor, but whatever. Perhaps observing you a while longer may prove amusing. I shall grant you an opportunity to make a deal with me. Should you wish it, I shall return the world to its prior state, one rampant with distorted masses. But... You dragged him into the metaverse and imposed an ordeal he did not deserve. Yet you still intend on toying with him? The Phantom Thieves will be praised and gain fame. The world will escape ruin as well. What say you? If I agree to this, the ruined city will return to normal. However, the people will remain trapped abandoning their ability to think for themselves. Is this is that really how the world should be? Well, doesn't seem like a bad deal, but because we're gonna continue with this game, I refuse. Well said. Such irredeemable foolishness. You choose death for yourself. Very well. I have no need for you. Oops. Sorry most of that was muted. Master. At least I think it was muted. Uh. Oh my. It's been quite a while since I last stepped foot in this place. Welcome to the Velvet Room. My name is Igor. I am pleased to make your acquaintance. He is the rightful master of this velvet room, the true aid on your journey. You know when I first saw Igor, I thought he would have a really high voice? This was the first Persona game I played. I first saw Igor, I thought he would have a really high voice. Then I heard his deep ass voice, I'm like, oh, never mind. And then I got to this point in the game, it's like, I guess I was right. And then I found out later that in previous games, he actually does have a higher voice. And then his voice actor died, so people thought that his deeper voice was just a recast. Was just a different direction the franchise was going. But nope, they duped us all on that. It may be difficult for you to understand this all at once. If I were to summarize this, the fake has left and the real has returned. Indeed. My master has returned, and you won against that malevolent god's temptation. Thus, you may be able to save this world that is headed towards certain ruin. Uh, I don't However, think we've won just yet. it will yet. prove difficult to win against him with your power alone. Uh, what should I do? You must release your teammates, with whom you've shared your conviction. <laughs> This place exists between dream and reality, mind and matter. The realm of the dreaming? Are you one of the endless? They have not necessarily expired yet. Just as you were trapped here, they should be confined somewhere as well. Since you've deepened your bond with them, I am certain you can release them. Once they, the Phantom Thieves, are all gathered here, we will tell you everything. Now go forth oh my God. to the people whom you should be facing the truth with. Your deeper voice matched that face more. The 
Phantom Thief should be imprisoned somewhere ahead. This is the first time we actually get to walk around in the Velvet Room. Let me see. So yes, quote unquote Igor was the last one we needed. So for now, behold, all of them are maxed out. I think, uh, can I save the game in here? No, I cannot. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to get this part done. And then I'll call it there. Wait, too far. I'm going to release all our teammates and then I'll call it there. So next time we could start with essentially a big ass muted portion. And, you know, continue. Joker, what a relief. You're safe. I'm relieved you're safe as too. Safe as too. Safe as well. Or safe too. Hmm? I, um... By the way... Why have you remained in your Phantom Thief attire while I'm back in regular clothes? Could this mean that the will of rebellion is no longer within me? <sighs> that may be true. We have to fight that Holy Grail again, correct? Could you imagine defeating it, Joker? That monster has the support of the masses, and with it, nearly an infinite amount of power. I... No matter which way I approach the subject in my head, nothing points to our victory. I think I finally, genuinely understand the pain my father and my sister were burdened with. Victory against a single criminal is meaningless. The true enemy is society itself. And even against that foe, you still have to try to somehow emerge victorious. I don't know what to do. Uh, believe in yourself or I'll be here for you. Uh, you know what, this one may be a little too cheesy. I'll be here for you. Joker, you're right. It's a bad habit of mine. The more critical the situation, the less I want to rely on others. Regardless, this isn't a situation with a straightforward answer. But even if there is no clear solution, I'll just have to make one with my own two hands. Before you guys came along, my life was defined by rules, set on a path of someone else's choosing. But only a true loser would live such a rigid life. I, I will win, even if it means going up against the entire world. I'm okay. My resolve was shaken, but it's stronger now. I want the people of the world to see what you've shown me. Right. Thank you. Having teammates you can trust is a great feeling. Shall we go? We can't let our last big job end in failure. Hey. Is everyone else locked up in this place as well? I see. Then, then it could be that they're all in the same state I was earlier. There doesn't seem to be any shadows around here. I'll wait somewhere nearby. As in, you won't move from the spot. You'll just stand still. I ask that you save everyone else. I'm pretty sure they need your help more than anything. Yes. I think it would be best you go alone. Alright. So we only have to do that like, what, seven more times? Six more times? So we'll just like, go around one level at a time. Oh, Joker. I'm relieved. Looks like we're both still alive. Am I really safe, though? Shibuya. 
What happened? And where are we? Uh, somewhere safe. I see. I guess my fears turned out to be true. The real world is a scary place. Pain like this can never reach you if you keep yourself cooped up indoors. Who am I to think I can tell the people what to do? I mean, I used to be a shut-in myself. Damn it. I just want to go home. But even that would be tough now. Giving up would be too painful. You know, I think I've changed. I don't know when it happened, but I can't... I can't let people suffer like this. Even if I don't know them personally. Grown? Honestly, this all seems like a bit too much. But... But... Hmm. Mm hmm I've known the right answer from the very beginning. I don't want to run away from this. I ran from my mom's death for so long. I misunderstood it. Everything was just too painful for me to handle. But I never want to be left in the dark again. That's probably why my persona is a little bit special. Because I want to learn the truth. That's how I really feel. Well, I've come this far. I'll follow you wherever you go, on my own two feet. You have such a strong heart, Joker. You saved me yet again. Thanks. I'm so happy. Like, so much that I can't even express it in my normal words. Anyway, we're going up against a god. I couldn't even leave my own room before. But now, we're gonna beat a god! I'm so pumped! And, wait a sec. I just noticed I got out of here on my own. Ta-da! A real jailbreak! Oh, you're quick to act. That's what makes you dependable. All right, time to get back at it. Hey, I hey. can't do anything but be silent on these. Just let them play out. Let you guys hear what they all have to say. So that's two. So got what? Four more. <clears throat> okay, who's over here? Nothing all the way there. It's Ryuji. Yo. Looks like we're both somehow still alive and kicking, but where at? Uh, I'm glad you're okay. Man, this prison cell kind of makes me think of when we first met. I remember how Shibuya was all effed up just now, but like, nobody was seeing any of it. No, it was more like they didn't want to see any of it. What the hell? So, even all them people who are suffering and cheering for us to come and help them, in reality, they would have rather just had everything stay how it was? Did what we were doing have any meaning at all? <laughs> You're so freaking tough. You know, back when I thought we were gonna die, without learning the truth about all this, I kind of felt for the first time that maybe we hadn't been doing the right thing. Maybe we deserve to lose. You get me? Uh... Now that I'm thinking about it, I, I started all this because of how pissed off I was. Maybe it's never been about winning or anything like that. Maybe all I was doing was just continuing my own defiance. It's... Fine? <laughs> You're right. I get it now. 
We're doing this to make sure people don't gotta go through the same crap we did. It doesn't matter if they think we're just or not. We gotta do what we believe in. <laughs> it's not like people think much of me anyways. I'm gonna dash through this the only way I know how. <laughs> you got me out of prison. Just like before. Thanks. You know, it's kind of embarrassing to say this, but uh, I'm really glad I met you. All right, I'm done getting my ass kicked. That shiny bastard acts like it's some kind of god. I ain't gonna feel good till we deal with it. Let's head out. We're gonna take down that asshole, yeah? That's what I like to hear. Hey. Do you, uh, you think the others are locked up to... Wow, I've never seen it spelled like that before. Others apostrophe R-E. Never really seen it spelled like that before. We'll be counting on you. All right, and just make my way down. That's the way I just came from. Yep, I'll just make. I'll just keep going. Do it one level at a time. Nothing. Nothing in the. Uh, you know the liminal space. Joker, as I expected, you appear to be safe. However, where exactly are we? Uh, you seem to be okay. Yes. Sorry to have worried you. At first, I was surprised to see the masses chained in a prison. Yet, here I am as well, considering the state of the real world. It is hard to say that we were even remotely helpful. This situation... Can we truly handle such horrid circumstances? All the Phantom Thieves can do is change the hearts of others. However, the world outside has become a veritable hell. Nothing within our power can fix that. I'm merely acknowledging how powerless I am. The people of this world desired their enslavement, and that isn't all. They screamed at us for attacking the Holy Grail, defended it. Even the criminals whose hearts we changed became meek followers of the Holy Grail because of us. Were we truly that foolish? Risking our lives for a result nobody desired. That's right. It wasn't just for recognition from those we were helping. My purpose lies elsewhere. When we first met, you continued to impose yourselves on me, no matter how much I pushed you away. I will forever treasure what you did for me. Very well. Just as art is meant to break boundaries, people should be saved even if they frown upon it. I won't allow the justice I believe in to be shaken any further. Allow me to thank you, Joker. Being by your side truly gives rise to the greatest ideas. Ah, yes. We cannot afford to leave reality in the hellish state it's currently in. I will make use of my role as an artist and paint over the distortions of society. Well then, time to go and see this through. I'll witness with my own two eyes that this world isn't bound by some holy grail. Well then, are the others here as well? <clears throat> Indeed. We will be counting on you. I like this. We get... We get a moment with each of the characters. I like this. I've always liked this. Okay, I think we got two more. We still have On and Haru. Oh, 
Joker, thank goodness you're safe. Oh, yeah. Huh. So, I'm not in heaven after all. That means the hell that Shibuya turned into was all real. <sighs> I'm so weak. When I thought I was gonna die, I... started trembling. I was just so scared. At that moment, nothing mattered. The justice of our actions was the last thing on my mind. Joker, you kept going, even through a plan that might have ended up killing you. Yet look at me. I've always said I'm doing this for other people. But that didn't get me far. <laughs> it's no wonder we lost. Maybe I should have just behaved myself and stayed out of all this. That's... You're right. I can never abandon her. If I whine like this now, I'd just be betraying Shiho. No. I'd be betraying myself. I could never forget how I felt that day. I... I never want anyone to have to go through what I did. I've made up my mind. I'm going to keep looking forward. Things like dying or losing aren't important now. All that matters is that I don't return to my old self. I'll never make a mistake like that again. I swear it. Thanks, Joker. You helped me remember what's really important. I seriously treasure being able to be a part of your team. Gotcha, Joker. It would be a disgrace to the Phantom Thieves' name if we didn't take such a big treasure. We're going to put an end to this, aren't we? Let's go! Hey! Can you, can you believe these guys are in Smash Brothers? Hey! Okay, one more. And then after Haru, we got a little bit of voice acting left. And then we continue. Next time, of course. You're safe. Oh, thank goodness. R right. Considering everything that has happened to the city, I wonder if the citizenry is okay. Although, it seemed like we were the only ones able to see it. You know, the moment I disappeared, I honestly thought I was about to die. But, part of me wasn't afraid. I knew that was all I could do, and looked forward to apologizing to Father face to face. Honestly, I thought I had changed, but I realize now that I still have no control over my life. It makes me sick. I'm sorry. I know you don't want to deal with my whining. You're going to try and defeat that thing again, aren't you? Don't push yourself to get me to come along. You can always leave me here if I'll slow you down. That's... That's right. I was foolish to think you should abandon me. Even if there are times where I think there's nothing I can do, I'll never stop fighting for you or our team. I won't give up anymore. Just as I betrayed my distorted father before, I will betray my boring former self now. Thank you, Joker. Before I met you, I had great admiration for the Phantom Thieves of Justice. And it's turned out you were exactly the person I always imagined you would be. This is the second time you've rescued me. I've secretly longed for a situation like this. We haven't lost yet. 
All right, and that's everyone. A little bit more. A little bit more, then I'll end it there. And I even said uh, this might be a shorter one. Yeah, right. Shorter one, my ass. What is this place? Who are they? Ah, the crossover My we haven't seen yet. Igor. These guys beating the these two. I am the master of the Velvet Room. I am Lavenza, a resident of this place as well. We have been waiting for all of you. Velvet Room? My master has just been released from a long period of imprisonment. His powers have not fully returned, though it may be presumptuous of me. I will speak on his... Hey, where's Morgana? Would you like to see him? You know him? He's right over there. That's where you were hiding? I... was born here. It was to dispel an evil being from man's spiritual world. Mona? My role was to find the trickster and help him defeat it. That's why I was created here by my master. Indeed. I really remember everything. When this place was about to be taken over, my master gathered the last traces of mankind's hope. He mustered up his remaining strength to make me. The entity that calls itself a god is a malevolent will that forces man into everlasting servitude. It hopes to attain eternal peace by filling reality with those who have stopped thinking for themselves. That is the ruin of man that this evil god envisions. I... um... don't get what you're saying at all. Oh, be quiet and listen! We don't have much time left! W wait a moment. The Holy Grail is... a, a god? I was wondering why it had a will of its own, but... Are you implying that it isn't a treasure? No. As the distorted desires of the masses, it is most certainly the core of Mementos itself. Then, did the treasure become a god because people wish to be ruled over? That is correct. To decide the fate of the world, it chose two people with potential and pitted them against each other. One. Goro Akechi incited the masses' distortion. Had he won, the world would have been destroyed and remade. The other was a trickster who would stand up against this. That was him. If he won, the human world would Whoops. be left as is. Those were the conditions of the game. At least, that's what should have happened. That malevolent being knew that a revolution would not occur within indolent humans. After all, With what it human? is the mass's distorted desires incarnate. Did she say indolent? However, my true master believed in humanity. He believed that a trickster would rise <clears throat> among the people and accomplish this change. But that evil entity laughed at the prospect and sought to prove the powerlessness of man with the game. And he had great potential, which is why it approached him. <clears throat> it helped train the trickster only to cast him into despair using the masses who rejected their savior. This was likely its means to nip in the bud anything that would pose a threat. Now that I think back to when I was separated, I felt a disagreement to the word rehabilitation. Of course I did. It was just a means for the fake to keep you under surveillance. Basically, this guy was dragged into a game where the evil god rigged the outcome. Damn it! What the hell? Your real world has already been fused with mementos. You do not exist because reality is replete with the cognition of those who deny the Phantom Thieves. It can be said that the world is one step away from the evil god's machinations. Doesn't sound that great. However, there is still hope. Now that the evil god's identity has been exposed, you can see your rehabilitation to its completion. Only you can leave this prison and save this distorted world and its captive people. Young man, guided by Morgana and worthy of the trickster name, 
You must challenge the evil god and reclaim your existence in reality. Are you up to the task? Let's destroy that annoying shiny treasure jerk for sure this time! <laughs> Excellent. There is nothing to fear. You already possess the strength to oppose this evil god. <laughs> I am truly looking forward to this. Our mutual friend knows where the exit is. Morgana? Please guide them, and thank you for all that you've done. It's a cruel responsibility that's been cast upon you. I will accept your words of appreciation fully when everything is over. Now follow me! Alright. This is a good spot to end it. Joker! And I'm not allowed to save the game! So, I, I will say, uh, pff, not save the game. I will end this part here. You know what, I'll end the screen on this beautiful sight of all, all the, everyone being done. You know what, no I won't. I'll just end it like this. Alright, so next time we'll continue. Next time, there, a big portion, wait, we're gonna start off with a big portion that's gonna play Life Will Change. So, uh, unfortunately, after that's posted, it's gonna be majority muted. But it is what it is. So, I'll see you guys next time for that. Eee, big stretch. Ugh. Alright, bye now.